Hi, this is a video review for the Targus um, wireless folding keyboard. Uh, it uh, uses Bluetooth uh, connectivity. It will connect to uh, Windows, Mac OS, Android, and iOS devices. I purchased this on the website or app called uh, Macari, and I will leave the seller's um, username uh, in the uh, description below. Great seller, great packaging, made sure everything was wrapped securely, so in transit, nothing got damaged, and um, I just really want to make sure you guys check out the seller's page. They're really five-star seller. Um, but here, here's what I purchased. Got a great deal. A um, lot better than buying it uh, brand new from a big box store retail price or even off of Amazon. I got a better deal than anywhere I can find. So please check out the seller's page. Here's, the, uh, here's what I purchased. I'll show you guys the back of the box. I have already obviously opened it up. Um, let's show you what it comes inside here. It's got like a clamshell box here. So here's the, the folding keyboard and then underneath here is the cable that it comes with. Now this cable charges your device and from what I've read, if you don't want to use the keyboard wirelessly, you could uh, plug it in hardwire with that wire to any device I'm assuming. Um, you would probably need to um, figure out how to get it connected, but they say you can use it hardwired. I never tested it out like that. So I'm going to switch the camera around so you can see um, the keyboard. And I'm going to show you really quickly how to set it up um, or how to pair it to a device. I'm going to be using the Motorola Moto G Stylus 2021. I've already used it on my iPhone and it works flawlessly. Um, so I'm going to show you guys how to connect it and how to use it. Okay, here is the keyboard folded, and let's unfold it. So here's what it looks like. Let me get you a closer look here. Now on this side. Okay, so um, I'm going to go through this really quick because I want to hurry up and show you guys how to use it. There's going to be two uh, LED lights here. This one should be uh, for um, pairing and when you're connected. This one is for, um, it will tell you what your battery level's at and uh, if your cap locks are on, it will light up or stay lit. So let's get this all ready to go. Okay. So I'm here using an Android device. Let's make sure it's... Uh, too blurry so you gotta go to your uh, bluetooth settings and pair new device so now when that's in pairing mode it's searching for a new device you have to um oh this automatically turns on once you open it up and once you close it it you know it saves the battery it shuts off but it's open it's on right now all we have to do is hit the function key let me let me get this uh focus okay hit the function key well first off before i do that you have three you can pair this to three different devices um uh, so here's one two three uh, i want to use number three so we're going to hit function and three see how the light turned on now we're on channel three just for the device itself because it can hold up to three and now i'm going to hit function and pair so now it's searching and trying to find another Bluetooth device. And the phone's trying to find another Bluetooth device. So let's wait till that actually um, pops up. And this is going to be in real time, so I'm not going to edit it. Okay, there, there's the name that... Let's focus this I, all the way at the bottom right here and it has a keyboard to the left that's the one we want to pair to 
It took a while, but it found it. So we're gonna click that there. And it's asking if we wanna pair it. So let's go ahead and pair. And I got a notification from my phone that it ringed and it said uh, that confirmed that we're connected to it. So we're connected. So here is the keyboard. Let's put this a little bit closer. So if you, let me focus here. Now, if you all, everything here, since it only has, let's see, one, two, three, four, five. Since it has five rows, it had to substitute some function keys and put them in the same keys with the uh, number keys. So anything that's blue, the only way to use a blue um, symbol, you have to hit the function key. Um, so the cool thing is it has a little house on F1 for the function key. If you hit function and one, it should take us, let's see, it took us home. Okay, perfect. And you can uh, use the brightness and the search feature here. If you hit function and search, it will automatically go to a Google shirt, search. Um, that's self-explanatory, uh, you know, backwards, pause, uh, play forwards, um, the volume rocker. So, you know, less volume, more volume. Um, this one is the battery indicator for the keyboard. So if you click it, it's gonna be hard to do with one hand. I don't think I could do it with one hand, but yeah, I can do it with one hand. But if you hit hold function and hit this battery or F10, it will light up this one on the right and tell you what's the uh, status of it. Uh, this function here is for like a screenshot. If you like, want to take a screenshot with your phone, um, it'll, it'll do a screenshot. And then if you hit the lock, it just shuts your phone off. It's not a shutdown, it just goes on standby mode. Um, and then I guess we can do a quick test. Um, so let me, let me launch the notes app here. And get a fresh note. So there is that. This is a test. There's that. So all this is working. We can focus. All that's working. You hit the enter key. It goes, you know, moves it lower. Um, so all of that is working. And, you know, it's just really cool. If I shut it, it comes off, obviously. And um, if I reopen it, so if I reopen it, it paired back with the phone and the phone made that noise. And I think it, you got to reactivate it and then you're back on. So really cool, really handy. You can put it almost anywhere and it doesn't take up much space. Let's compared to size with the phone. So I think that's gonna be it. Um, oh, and here's the charger. That's how you charge it, it's up there. And here's the back of it. So it's a pretty cool device, um, definitely cool. You can take it anywhere and um, it's got an er ergonomic design. Uh, that's why it's split in half and it's, their boat, it's caved um, or it's angled, you know, differently for your hand. So it's more natural. So uh, that's going to be it. Thanks for watching. Uh, please comment, rate, subscribe, check out the seller's page on Macari and um, thanks. Appreciate it.